Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am here with my weekly What I Melted video. I am early. Today is Friday the 23rd. So this is the melts from Monday the 19th to Friday the 23rd. Usually I do Monday to Sunday, but as I've mentioned before, my in-laws are coming into town tomorrow and I'm not going to be melting a lot. I'm not going to have time over the two weeks to do videos because my husband's going to be on vacation. He's taking the whole two weeks off that they're here. And so I'm going to have my in-laws and my husband sitting here all day, every day. So there's going to be, I'm going to have zero downtime to do any videos. So I am recording all these hauls or hauls and empties and whatnot now. I may not upload them till next week just because um, I do have other things I need to upload first. Um, so... You may not see them till Monday or Tuesday, but these are recorded on Friday the 23rd. So, um, I'm doing my What I Melted video. I'm doing my February Empties video, and I have two hauls. So, I'm going to be recording all those. Um, I have a bunch of wax coming in over the next few days. Um, I was hoping to get, the, get it all in today, but it's not going to happen. So, um, or by today. It's not going to happen, and so I'm going to wind up having... I'm just going to stack the boxes up, and after they leave, I will do those hauls. So, first things first, I finished a clam of Annabeth. Annabeth is one of my absolute favorite saltwater taffy scents. The pink sugar really sweetens it up. It's really good. Just a very sweet scent. I really enjoy the scent. Um, I didn't want to finish it. I do have several clams. I have probably three more clams besides this one. I didn't want to finish it up... Because I still had, I had four cubes when I put this in my bin. But then last night I melted two and there was only two this morning. I thought, well, I'm not going to put a two, two cube clamshell away. So I put that on this morning to finish up the clamshell. Um, I'm trying to go through and finish up a lot of things so I don't have to put them away. I'm having to put boxes like under my bed right now. Um, because I just don't want them out and my in-laws go, hey, what's all this? You know, you could be saving for retirement in 30 years. And it's like... Sorry. Um, so I would rather keep the peace and just hide the wax than deal with that. So this one is one of my favorites. It is just a very sweet scent. I love pink sugar blends and that salt water taffy is just a beautiful blend. Then I melted Governor. I got this in a de-stash um, or a de-stash trade from my friend Rebecca. I actually really like this scent. Um, I didn't like it the first time I melted it last year. And then she was doing like a single cube de-stash like I do. And I went ahead and I um, grabbed a couple of the, um, she, there were band bag pieces, I think. And so I put one in my kitchen last night. I put one in my bathroom this morning. I love it. It is like, it is lemonade and clean cotton. And my husband really likes clean cotton. He loves the Yankee clean cotton. So um, I figured lemonade mixed with it. Lemonade and laundry. I love lemon laundry. I love lemon lavender. I love laundry and anything or clean cotton and anything. So I really do enjoy it now where I didn't before. I finished up this frosted pink party cake. I bought this from a D stash the other day. Um, it is on the older side. It is a year and a half old. So I figured I would just melt it up. It was a big, like, it was like not really a bun. It was kind of like a bun, um, but it was hollow in the middle or it was empty in the middle. And so I cut it up. I've melted it several times. I put the last two pieces on this morning. Um, this is a very, very nice bakery scent. I love Southbound's um, strawberry. And when you mix her strawberry with cake, it is just a beautiful blend. And this threw very, very well. Um, it was just something that I wanted to get used up. I'm trying to slowly finish up the 2016 wax that I've acquired. I'm doing a lot of 2016 VCS. I'm doing, um, anything from 2015 I'm finishing up. And so, um, I want to by the middle of the year have all the 2016 gone so I can start on 2017 because the early 2017 stuff will be good and cured by then. Then this I put in the kitchen. This was a sample I got from a D stash. It's some like it hot. We'll always have Paris. Um, it was a couple loaf pieces I just threw in my kitchen this morning. Again, it was less I have to put away later. Um, so I just was trying to finish up a bunch of stuff this week. Um, that was little bits, half, half cent shots, you know, one or two cubes of, you know, samples, that kind of stuff. This is a really nice fruity scent. Um, I really enjoy that in the kitchen. 
I melted some grandma's pearls last night in the bedroom. Now I will be doing my bedroom melts um, for the next two weeks because we do melt at night regardless of who's here and what's going on. Um, so I may actually just put those in my bin and then at the end of the two weeks I may just do what I did melt because I will be melting bedtime and I may be keeping my bathroom warmer on because with six people in this house and one bathroom I think I'm going to need it to smell good honestly. Um, so I think I will keep those two warmers going 24 seven. And so I may do a, what I melted video when they leave, um, with what I did get through over the course of the two weeks between the bedroom and the bathroom. And if we're home a lot, I may turn on the other warmers, but we do a lot of like day trips and we do a lot of just going out. And so I, I, I don't want to keep the warmers on if we're going to be gone for like six, seven hours. So, um, I may do that instead. But anyways, I like Grandma's Pearls. It's uh, marshmallow, lavender, vanilla. It is on the lighter side to me, but it's still a very good blend. I broke into my Warren's Loaf um, the other day. Gooey marshmallow, glazed cinnamon, don't cider lane. I actually put some of this in the living room warmer last night. Um, I broke into it because I had just gotten it in a D-stash and there was a hole in the bag. It was in the plastic polypropylene bag and there was a hole in it. So I wound up chopping it. It's a full loaf. So I wound up chopping it and I just put a piece in the living room. This is such a beautiful blend. This is one I will melt all year long. It is, um, you know, it is very cidery and very fall-y, but it is beautiful. So I will melt that all year long. Penguin I finished up. Um, Blackberry Jam Ocean Rain Pink Sands. I love this in the bathroom. It is such a fresh scent. That Ocean Rain and Pink Sands is beautiful. I really enjoy it. Next is Rue Bedtime Bath Baby Powder Magnolia Blossoms. This one's another favorite of mine. This needs to get restocked soon. I'm down to one clamshell. Um, I really am kicking myself for not picking up a sidekick in this scent. I cannot get anybody to part with theirs. I have been begging <laughs> to buy a sidekick because for some reason I thought, oh, well, I don't melt a lot of bedtime. I really don't melt a lot of bedtime scents, but I just want more. I don't like having one clam of one of my favorites. This is just a very nice calming blend. It is beautiful. Vanilla Lavender from Warm Tarts Make Happy Hearts. They were teddy bear shapes. I think there was like four in the pack or something. Um, and I finally finished up the last one. This is a beautiful scent. I would actually purchase, I've never purchased from Warm Tarts Make Happy Hearts. I got this as a extra in a D stash. I would definitely order from her because that was beautiful. Um, I got this in a D stash the other day, Basic Witch from Southbound. It's pink sugar, toasted marshmallows and witching hour, which is campfire smoke and sweet gooey marshmallow cream. It's um, some leftover uh, le uh, loaf pieces. Um, I have like six clam, five or six clamshells of this, and then I have this. So I figured I'd start on this because these were older than the clamshells. The clamshells I just got in like December, January. Um, this is a beautiful, beautiful blend. I love the campfire smoke blends. Um, and I actually got a partial bag of witching hour with this same D stash. So I was so happy for this. This is just so gorgeous. And that pink sugar just sweetens it up even more. It is a beautiful blend. Then I melted another cube of Sunset Island Sands. I do these, this one in the bathroom. So I melted one cube last week and I melted one cube this week. Um, this is a very nice blend. I'm not sure whether or not I would repurchase it, but it is beautiful. I finished this bag of strawberry cotton, candied fro cotton candy frosted cake. I always do that. I always say candid frosty cake instead of candy frosted cake. Um, this was a very beautiful blend. Um, I only had like two, three pieces left. So I threw them in the warmers throughout the house the other day just to finish it up. Um, this was just a gorgeous strawberry light cake blend. It was just beautiful. I would definitely repurchase that. Mermaid. This is another thing that came in that trade from Rebecca. This was nice. Um, it's like ocean water and like watercress or something like that. Um, it's a very nice blend. I put it in the bathroom. I would definitely pick up a clam of that. I wouldn't buy it in bulk, but I'd buy a clam. 
I finished up that loaf of Cafe Reggio. It's Cafe Mocha Marshmallow. This one, I only had one little loaf piece left after I did my weekly melts last week, so I figured I'm not putting one piece away. So I finished this up. I When I bought this, it was a half loaf. I bought in a D-stash. I, I do have two blossom bags um, still, so I'm good, but my husband kept saying, you can't buy more of that scent until you use some of what you have up because I did have it in bulk. Now that I finished this, I can go nay, nay, nay and buy some more. It's beautiful. I try, I melt it almost every week. Strawberry birthday cake from Sugar and Spice. I love the scent. I love her strawberry. I love it. I, I tend to say I love her strawberry, but I love everybody's strawberry, really. This was a very nice um, strawberry, you know, cake blend. I finished Ron. I think it was just one cube left. Magica Delicious and Creamy Orange Sherbet. I love this scent. Um, this is one I will melt all year long. The orange sherbet is more of a summery scent to me, but it's just beautiful with that magical delicious. It's more creamy and a hint of bakery, but I love Ron. Ron is a favorite. I finished my very first scoopable Americana marshmallow smoothie. It's marshmallow, uh, monster cookie marshmallow smoothie, blackberry jam butter cookie. This is the very first scoopable I've ever finished. I am like, yeah, it is such a good blend. I love this scent. I melted some Cheshire's Grin. It's Lavender Birthday Cake Cotton Candy Frosting Marshmallow. I did this in the bedroom. I like it. It is light to my nose. So it's not a favorite, but I do like it. I finished a clam of Starfleet. There was just two left, so I fin or two cubes left. So I finished, I'd, I figured I'd finish it up. I went ahead and put it in the bathroom or bedroom and living room the other day. It's such a nice zucchini bread bakery. I really, really, really enjoy that. I finished Ghost Munch Cookie Butter Crack from Sugar and Spice. This one's really good. It is more of a fall type scent. I think there's like a cider note to it. and um, But it's still really good. One of my favorites. Lemon Pound Cake from Sugar and Spice. This is another very good lemon bakery scent. I loved it. Absolutely loved it. Um, it is one that I would definitely pick up again. And finally... Um, I melted a piece of this mystery blend from Sugar and Spice. This is how her samples come. They come in a mystery blend. You don't know what they are. She doesn't know what they are. I cut this in quarters like I usually do. I put it in the bathroom. It has like a laundry scent to it. It's really nice. So I'm glad I put that in the bathroom. So that's what I got through. That's not bad for four full days. Um... Mon yeah, yeah, four full days because it was all day Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and then today I only put half my melts in. So really it's four days and a half. So um, I tried to, I finished quite a bit. I have just a few things to put back away, which is fine. And then, um, like I said, I will be doing my bedtime melts when my in-laws are here. I will be doing bathroom melts. So I will put together um, something for the next uh right after they leave or if there's a time where like my husband and them go somewhere which is very rare that like never happens um i may do a video but anyways i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll talk to y'all later bye